Okay. Let us <coughs> go to Castle Town. Mail. Mr. Balls, wait! <coughs> Greetings, Mr. Balls. I have come to deliver a letter. There's a letter for you. Balls? Three letters, in fact. Oh well, my business is concluded. Onward to mail. Well, let's check my mail, I guess, before I go fight pure darkness. Challenge for you, Purlo. Ladies and gentlemen, the star game that has swept Hyrule by storm is now available in Castletown. Even those of you who have beaten it once will find all new challenges and thrills. Come find us in the tent on the East Gate Road. We'll be waiting. You see, and that's the thing is like, I'm on purpose not doing 100% of everything I'm try like in the game. So I'm not even like experiencing all that there really is to the, de the depth of the game. Which is, you know, they're like all the different side stuff you do for all the heart pieces and whatnot. And other, like, just things you can do in the game. I, uh... Yeah, it would, it would be interesting to come back to this and try to 100% the game at some point, I think. Wow, kid, awesome! My son said that he wanted to write you a letter. He worked so hard on it. Goodness, yes. We thank you for all your help, both on land and in the sky. The other Okoka, thank you as well. Come visit us anytime. Take care. Thanks, Junior. Dear Balls, after we parted, I tried to word all this. Uh, I tried that word on all the statues I could find in Hyrule, but it was a disaster. How disappointing! But if I let something so small get to me, my dear father will scoff at me from beyond the mortal coil. I'm going back to the sanctuary in Kakariko Village to see if I can't find another lead. I certainly hope that you if you find any more information, you will share it with me post-haste. The Dream Chaser, Shad. Well, it's too bad I'm never going to see you again, Shad. Because <laughs> I'm going to go fight Ganon, and you can shove it. Right. It'd be great if everybody was like, Go do Shad's quest! Do Shad's quest! God damn it! Alright. Not doing Shad's quest. <laughs> <clears throat> Yo, what's up, Daigen? How's it going? I hope you're well. Oh shit! Oh, Midna's... Midna, why are you hitting yourself? Stop hitting yourself, Midna. Stop hitting yourself. Stop, stop hitting yourself. <laughs> well, bye, Midna. It's good. Good knowing you. Holy mother of fucking Jesus, what? Holy fuck. <laughs> what the hell? crazy there's so much bloom it's fucking intense there's so much bloom oh my god it's blooming everywhere blooming onions god it's so fucking white everywhere Uh, this is on Wii. This is on an actual Wii. 
Yeah, I mean, this game just had a lot of Bloom going. And I mean, a lot of games around this time kind of used Bloom to make, I think, just to kind of try and make games look a little bit better. But yeah, Legend of Zelda is very heavily, it goes hard on the Bloom. They go ham. They're very, they've, it's very much an aesthetic part of this game. And I mean, to be fair, Z Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess for 2006 looks good, in my opinion. Uh, oh, Hyrule Castle, it's raining like fuck. Okay. I'm gonna throw my shit at these trees. Yeah, I would hope they would. Um, I mean, I think by the time HD came out, Bloom was more of, like, a bad thing. <laughs> like, having Bloom in your game didn't really look very good, in my opinion. Like, if you find games nowadays with Bloom, it's kind of... I mean, not good. It's... I don't know. I mean, it might be that there's just different kinds of Bloom now. But I mean, it's probably just more that Bloom's just really outdated and like just having dynamic lighting and other like, well, maybe not dynamic lighting, but like having just actual lighting, I think is kind of, I don't know. I don't know exactly how to explain. It's not, it's not like just a graphics thing to make it look, try to make up for the fact that it's, you know, a fucking GameCube game. Or a Wii game. I don't even know if the Wii game was graphically any better. I don't think it was, but... Yeah, no, I mean, I think it works pretty well, especially for the time. I think it looked really good, because, I mean, what, Twilight Princess on GameCube looked like this, right? Pretty much. And that was, what, 2004 <laughs> or something? Well, yeah, I know it's also on Wii. I'm just saying, like, I don't know if the Wii version looks better or not, but... I mean, so if this is, like, more like when the GameCube version came out, these graphics are definitely decent, in my opinion. So I think Twilight Princess on GameCube was, like, 2004 or something. Maybe I'm wrong. Either that or it was 2005 or six. Honestly, can't even. Yeah, I'm. I'm aware of that. Yeah, I'm aware of the at least the uh, the changes they made, which was literally just flipping it <laughs> and adding some motion controls in. Um. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, it really sucks when game when you ex when you buy a game that doesn't work. It seems like Twilight Princess is kind of finicky too, because my disc is not in great shape. It's not in super bad shape, really, for how most Wii games. Like most of the Wii games that are in this, uh, the shape that the my Twilight Princess disc is, most of the time they don't really have any problems at all. But I've had Twilight Princess. Like every now and then, do the disc can't be read thing, or just straight up be like, yeah, no, error has occurred, dumbass, get a better disc. And it's like, it's not even really like, it's not even most of the disc, it's just like one, probably one or two little spots that have bad scratches. And yeah, it, I mean, overall, it's working fairly fine, but. Like, for example, I wouldn't use this for, like, a speedrun or anything, just because it would be way unreliable. It would be pretty likely that at some point in time during one run, I would at least have one time where the disc's like, Nah, fuck you, I'm just gonna not work. So much rain. Everywhere. I don't, no, I don't care if people talk about emulators at all. I don't give a fuck. People can do what they like. I don't use emulators, so I can't really help 
that much. The only emulator I use is VBA, and that's to play Pokemon ROM hacks. Whenever I'm bored and just wanting to... Well, I mean, it's not that when I'm bored, it's more like when I'm just randomly feeling like play, playing Pokemon. Sometimes, you know, you just see some people playing Pokemon, and you're like, man, I kind of want to play some Pokemon now. And that's how it goes. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, emulators especially, like, emulators aren't even technically illegal anyway. Like, even if they were, I wouldn't really care, but... As far as, like, discussion about it, but... Um, but, yeah, it's only, like, ROMs and stuff. Like, I would say people probably shouldn't link ROMs in my chat, but it's not, like, a thing that happens regularly or anything, so... Yeah, I mean, um, I'd say Dolphin probably would be a good way to going, of going about playing the game, for sure. Because, I mean, if you're wanting to play the GameCube version, which is just, like, flipped uh, uh, from this and doesn't have motion controls, um, <clears throat> then, yeah, I mean, like, that version is definitely pretty spendy nowadays, so... Can't blame anybody for wanting to play the game and not spend like 50 bucks. Uh, are these? Oh, these are bushes. Yeah, as far as I know, Dolphin's pretty reliable if your computer's okay. so rainy. <laughs> it's so foggy and rainy. I kind of like it though because it almost makes it feel like not a dungeon but it is a dungeon. That's that's one thing I've really liked about Hi uh, Twilight Princess so far is there's like one or two dungeons that are kind of like they just don't really f like the sky dungeon and this dungeon don't really feel as much like dungeons as much as you just wandering around some fucking crazy castle but I have come to play okay Pretty, how do you beat these guys hmm. I don't remember. probably just let him swing or something Um, I don't think Twilight Princess was ever put on Switch, no. I don't think any Zelda game has since Breath of the Wild. And maybe, like, <laughs> whatever that fucking game's called, um, Hyrule, uh, no, I, I mean, I guess Hyrule Warriors was put on there, but that's not the game I'm thinking of. I think Hyrule Warriors was put on Switch, though. Um, I'm trying to think of, uh, Cadence of Hyrule, that's what it is. That fucking rhythm game. I think that was put on Switch. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure it is. I don't think there's any other Zelda games on Switch besides, like, virtual console releases, but... Link, why do you miss so much? Like, half the time, I'm, like, locking on, and Link's just like, how about I just don't? Like, there. Like, he just missed twice. Link, fucking hit him, you idiot. Dude, Link, Jesus, hit him, you fucking dumbass. God. Enough. You got a small key. I like this point of view. It's like Link is like like you're a tiny little person, a mini person, and Link's just like holding you up in front of a floating key.
I follow the strongest side. That is all I have ever known. Balls. He... He spoke. <laughs> uh, uh, that was good. Okay. That was funny. Alright, um... Oh, hey, a chest. Right, Midna, can you just shut the fuck up for 30 seconds? Holy fucking shit. I haven't talked all my life, but really, just shut up. Shut up, Midna. Just shut the fuck up, Midna. God. Damn. That'd be a good one. I think that'd be good. <laughs> yeah, I guess that's true. Link does, Link does talk in the cartoon in the CDI version. Link's just always trying to get laid in the cartoon. That's literally all Link does all the time. <laughs> Is he's just like, but how about a kiss, princess? Oh, nice fucking shot, dipshit. I did not mean to use that item. Thanks. <laughs> Don't even remember switching the cursor. Uh, okay. Some boars. Okay. Fuck the po fuck the establishment. Uh so this is where we came in. Wait, no it's not. I'm confused. I'm confused here. 
One second. I just need to scratch my butt. Uh, is it G? Okay. Yeah, that's the thing about Zelda that makes it a little bit, like, it's not annoying really, but it's more like it just doesn't really make sense w with a lot of puzzles where it's like, oh, you know, you can, you can take down this giant, you know, fucking <coughs> tower thing that the uh, enemies are standing on, but... You can't get rid of the fences that are made of the exact same fucking, probably the exact same fucking wood. So I think it's, yeah, it's kind of funny. <coughs> Sorry. Um. <coughs> yeah, it's humorous. It's just one of those things where it's like, well, you know, if it doesn't work on the fence, why would it work on this, you know? So you might just wander around forever being confused because, you know. The fuck was that? The hell... The hell did Link just do? He just did like a weird thing. I don't know, maybe it was just because I tapped Z at just the right time that it looked really weird? <laughs> Weird as fuck. Okay, um, so this is where I came in, and there's the boars. Do I want? Oh, I guess maybe I want the boars just to go through all the shit in there. Yeah, I mean, it's like it's like bombing a wall, like in the regular Zelda game. It's like bombing a wall that has no indication that you're supposed to bomb it, and then just. You know, like, the first Zelda game was ridiculous with that, where it's like, literally, you just, some places, to find random secrets in the game, you just had to bomb random fucking tiles on walls, or just do really weird random shit. And I mean, it's not that it's like that weird, it's just more like you'd have to spend a lot, a lot of time not only getting bombs to begin with, like, going and grabbing a shitload of bombs to then go and just spam everywhere. Or, you know, or just buy Nintendo Power, which was 99% of the reason why it was just fucking cryptic as fuck. What the fuck? Oh, he's chilling. Yeah, the pigs destroy the fences. That is one thing that you do earlier on in the game. And I mean, to be fair, I think you might do this. I think you do that. I think you can hit the things down with the ball and chain anyway. Like the towers, the ball and chain at other points in the game. I just kind of forgot about it. Like the, uh... I don't know if it's Arbiter's Ruins. I think that's the temple. Like outside of the Arbiter's Ruins. I think there's like a section where you can basically do that. Not sure though. Uh, what do we need? A song of time as a wolf here. And okay. Do the thing. Do the th do the thing. Aren't you curious? What's on the other side of this wall? Balls. <laughs> this wall balls. <laughs> check. Uh, there might be a way in. Want to check it out? Do I want to check it out then? Oh. Pretty much. Is Midna ugly yet? <laughs> Get the fuck off my back, Midna. I'm not your fucking horse, you stupid. God damn it. Okay.
Oh jeez, it's a bunch of midgets. It's a bunch of midget skeletons, oh god. I was worried there for a second. Thank god I still have lantern oil, am I right? What? 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 Fucking... Why does this not work? Why does my lantern not work? God damn it. What the fuck do I do with these? I don't even know what these torches are for. I don't know if I've seen these torches, but maybe it's just because it's raining out that it's not letting me. It's probably the reason. Probably. Probably something like that. Which is Oh, okay, he can slip. See, I was wondering what the fuck that was. Like, he did a little slip thing. Either that or I did a stab animation and I didn't even realize it. Yeah, she's not quite ugly yet. What the fuck is this shit? Just a pile of bricks. I'm bombing your pile of bitch ass, brick ass, ass, ass and ass, fuck. Okay. In the land where the rain stops, the statue of time moves. Well, how the fuck do I do that? <laughs> the cursed swordsman sleeps before the sacred tree. These affidavits. What? Not affidavits. Fucking these. Is it affidavits? These fucking gravestones are stupid. Whoever died there, it's, I, he deserved to die. I was there to defend him. There's a lot of skeletons here. They just like get back up anyway, don't they? The sun sets in the east when Link does something. This one doesn't have a hammer. Leave me alone, I just want to figure shit out. <laughs> oh, let me try this again. Nope, okay. Hmm. So, like, am I supposed to play the sun song or something? Am I supposed to just know the sun song by now and I just am dumb and don't have it? Which is the one song that we need for sure in the entire game. Besides Song of Time, I guess. But I, I, don't, I think I learned Song of Time when I need it. Well, I don't even know. Maybe you can learn uh, Song of Storm somewhere around here. <sighs> okay, uh... Hmm. Yeah, maybe I learn it in that one area that I haven't been to yet that's behind the locked door or maybe I learn it at that one little spot um, maybe I just need to search around here with this shit
Oh, we're supposed to talk to this dude. Got money. Is this just literally money? Is there nothing to fucking get out? Okay, wait, now I'm done. Fucking damn it. <laughs> wow, I lit a fucking fire and Somehow that put out the rain. Okay. Okay. Yeah, all right. Stupid. All right. Fucking light thing, Link. You fucking dumbass. Light thing. Why is it not working? Oh. Did I not do it in time? Is it like a time thing? just really confusing since I just happened to get there right when it was ending. Uh, anyway, um... Alrighty, what do we got here? Door opens where specters gaze. Probably somewhere over here, or back at the tree, maybe. Maybe at the graves. Did that just happen? Oh, I was like, what the fuck? Uh, Specter's gaze. Like up here? No, like those patches of grass. Uh, up here? Or something? Maybe? Looks like a place to go. I'd imagine the devs wouldn't be like, oh yeah, you know, and they can just get that stuck, and then that's cool. If that happens. No big deal.
Okay. A small key, yo. Sick. You've gotten everything you can out here. Now get in the castle through the front door. Then, uh, don't tell me what to do. is it? I came in through this hole. Oh, there's the hole. Okay. We just gotta go in through the other hole. As is tradition. Front door, I guess. Oh. You're telling me they block this off? Stupid. Never mind. <laughs> no, they didn't block me off because I literally already did this like several times. I just forgot. Oh. Hit it. I wasn't gonna clear the way though. So I'm confused. Uh, wait. Oh, there it is. Never mind. There's just a boar. <laughs> I thought I just couldn't see it. You know, probably because it's foggy as all hell. I just want some hearts, god damn it. Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> I like the music. I love the intense amount of lag you get when, the, when you kill more than one enemy. I mean, I don't know if that's kind of not necessarily lag, but like the game like just kind of does that whenever you hit something and just, it just slows down or whatever. But. All right, cinematic, yeah. Exactly. Compass. The last compass in the game, Pog. Assuming this is the last temple. I'm I'm mis I'm pretty sure it is. <laughs> um Pretty sure there's only Ganon left. Uh in terms of like full bosses. Major bosses. Uh Okay. I guess we'll go through here, fuck it. Oh, hi. Hi there. How's it going? How's the family? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna mosey on over to this, uh... Oh. Okay. Dang it, fucked up. Oh, you know, I forget. I think I just need to bomb someone. Dang it. I forget how you f fight these guys. I honestly can't even remember. Maybe I, like... Oh, maybe. Do I do the shield bash thing? Can I do that to these guys? Oh, can I? I don't think I can. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, I think I need to let them attack and then miss and then I'll attack. Yeah. Okay. That's what I do. Okay. Oh, okay. That was weird. Somehow that hit? Okay. I guess if you just also just somehow hit anyone. Okay. I need to not stand so close, I think. That was pretty badass. Oh god. Oh 
fuck, dude. I'm so dead. Yeah, I'm, I'm dead as fuck, dude. Something. Maybe I need to backflip. Or maybe I. No, you know what? Maybe now I do the shield bash thing. No, I don't. Okay. I suck dick at this fight. Yeah, I'm screwed. I'm definitely losing this fight. There's like no doubt about that. Like maybe I do bomb now? I don't know. Oh, there goes my health already. That sucks. Dang, dang, dang. Link, you just suck too much. God, it's so hype that you restart with three hearts. Super hype. Definitely love starting fights like this with three hearts. Always feels good. Nice. Might as well run into the fucking wall and do some help. Fucking dead now, though. Dude, because there's just no way I'm surviving fucking anything. Yep, it's all it takes, man. Just fucking like three or four hits. Super fucking hype. Oh boy, do I love having to go and scavenge some health. It's not like the most tedious and boring fucking thing in all of Zelda. Total of one health. 
That's awesome. It's fucking hype. Like, it'd be better if I just saved and quit the fucking game. That's how much ridiculously faster this would be, I think. I'm pretty sure if you save and reset, you still start with, like, full hearts. I don't know. But it's fucking ridiculous. Maybe it's just the hearts you had anyway, but... Oh, man. I love spending, like, ten fucking minutes of my life doing this shit just because, God forbid... I fucking know how to do a boss fight immediately. Yeah. God forbid I don't know. <sighs> Lest I waste another half hour of my fucking life. Not a fairy in sight either. This is awesome. Super helpful. Literally took out like everything in this courtyard and only got only like six health. This temple's already fucking annoying. <laughs> like, yeah, let's just put health nowhere. Suck a fat one, dude. up Isaiah. Well, that only took like five fucking minutes that could have easily been solved by just, I don't know, putting hearts literally anywhere inside. Instead of just fucking one. <laughs> Let's put one on the opening floor, because shove it up your ass. because how we do difficulty is we just artificially increase the difficulty by making you do shit longer. Shit that just makes it just take longer because fuck you. Didn't have my sword out. Awesome. I am always. I just love that you have to fucking swing motion controls to get your sword out, and then like 90 fucking percent of the time, it takes forever to pull your sword out because motion controls suck. The amount that Link misses too is just so fucking tight. Nice, nice fucking, nice fucking swing, Link. It's super hype how much Link just fucking misses whenever you try to do anything. 
like, oh yeah, homing attack, except I actually just right past them. Oh man. How did I even fucking hit this guy before, honestly? Uh, good thing I got some more fucking health, because I'd literally almost be dead by now. Probably still going to fucking die here because I'm a fucking idiot. Just can't even. I, I'm pretty sure I did at least one fight of this, like this in the Temple of Time. I'm not sure if it was this difficult though. Yeah, just fucking do nothing, dude, for like 10 seconds straight. Sick. Hmm. Fucking transform into the wolf, because this is stupid as shit. I love the way that Twilight Princess detects which control, which fucking direction you're pushing when you're trying to do flips and stuff. It's actually fucking so obnoxious. It actually is so fucking stupid. It's so awesome when you're just like literally nice. Awesome. That's so cool. Dude. That's awesome. I definitely deserve that death. Put the health pots right next to the fucking, right next to the fucking wall. It's totally not fucking stupid as shit at all. Uh. Honestly, man. That was a real good one. Ten out of ten joke.
Nice. Trying to fucking backflip and it just being out. Nah, actually, nah, you're fo you're holding forward. You're you're definitely holding forward, idiot. No fucking health for this. So, well, that was a good fight while it lasted, huh? Definitely holding back, dude. Probably not even hitting him the right way. Probably just dicking around here. Wasting my fucking time. Yeah, I have a feeling like this literally isn't doing anything. Okay, well, that's fun. That's fun and all. my sword out. Why'd I have to do that every single fucking time I want to attack? Thank <laughs> you. 
All right, let's go and fail this again. Oh, good fucking hit, dude. Literally fucking nothing useful to offer. Awesome. Fucking hard to counter this guy with Link, honestly. Like Link just fucking sucks so much. <laughs> Good fucking spin attack though, you dipshit. Yeah, okay, well that did nothing. Awesome. Five health later, and I am still no fucking further. Awesome. Yeah. 
What the fuck do I do man? Honestly. Fucking swing. It's not It's not countering shit. Somehow that hit makes no fucking sense at all. I'm literally just randomly fucking pressing A here. It's fucking balls to the walls, dude. Awesome. Honestly. I think I just barely figured out the timing too, is the thing. If only the joystick crap wasn't totally annoying. Like basically if the camera didn't entirely determine whether or not you could backflip. Like depending on what joystick angle you're pushing. Complete fucking garbage camera. Like, if you're targeting something and trying to backflip, it's actually just super dumb. <laughs> God forbid you try to ta target something and then actually use anything but a button to, like, actually attack. <laughs> Is this just more lantern oil? Interesting. like something else here I need to activate yeah it was a hard fight it's just like the timing is just really weird and I've done a fight against one of those guys before so that's another thing that was just like it was a lot harder than I remember either that or I it, or either that or it just actually was a harder fight than the other one I think you only fight nice floating arrow I was thinking that was like a bug like not a not a I was thinking that was like a dragonfly or something. Nice arrow. Yo, Ninja Frog, thank you for the follow, dude. I appreciate that. Yeah, the camera is just not super great when, you tra when you're when you targeting stuff, and I kind of don't like that. That's probably the... I mean, like, besides the bad motion controls from the Wii itself, it's probably one of the only things I don't really like that much about this game. <laughs> uh, is this fu yeah, it's pretty much that fucking targeting is awful if you're trying to like, do backflips and stuff, which it feels like against those guys, that's kind of the point, but um, let's see, where are we going then? What is the last thing we activate here? I'm just totally missing something here. The thing about it is, is I feel like I still didn't really do that fight very well at all, so the fact that I won just kind of felt like I more of just got lucky. <laughs> But, I don't know, it's interesting that, um, I don't know if the wolf even does any damage against those guys, because it seemed like any time I was attacking with the wolf, which seemed a lot easier to time, it didn't seem like it was doing any damage. Maybe it's just that the 
Master Sword just does significantly more. Where the fuck? Maybe I need to deactivate this one. Yo, let's go. Can we even get up there, though? <laughs> I mean, I get it now, but fuck, dude. God damn it. Really? Oh, it took me a thousand years to get through this room. Yo, sick. Totally worth it. Uh, okay. Yeah, that boss was fucking tough, dude. Jesus Christ. I I sucked at that. I mean, the, the funny thing is about that is I struggled with that mini-boss probably more than almost any boss in the entire game so far. Like, even Zant wasn't that difficult for me. <laughs> <laughs> Which is hilarious. I think that's pretty funny, actually. Um. Yo, Ente, what up? How's it going, man? Thank you for the host, dude. Hope you're well. Not lighting them fast enough, I think that's it. What? Am I just stupid? Maybe I am. Alright, have a good night, MK. Thanks for the host, dude. Thank you for the raid, I hope you sleep well, man. them in a certain order. Why the fuck? Do some just go out way earlier? I don't understand. Is there just another one I am missing here? Straight up. Pattern on the floor, some stupid shit. Doesn't seem like it. That one went out like immediately. Uh, so I'm like just supposed to see which ones last the longest. I guess. Uh. took an entire thing of lantern oil for me to figure that out, but... Oh, I have lantern oil. Oh, let's go and get more. You can just fill the lantern by swinging it. That's actually awesome. That's pretty sick. 
Okay. Wait, are both of those out now? What the fuck? There's like literally no point in even raising the other two. Just to debate you. Yeah, okay. Uh, I think the Sky Dungeon was decent. I don't know. Temple of Time was decent, although pretty linear. Arbiter's Grounds was cool. I thought the ice temple was neat. Um, also, I think I think most of the temples were pretty all right. <laughs> this one's only kind of stupid because there's just like literally no health laying laying around. So if you die, you just have to go spend a thousand years uh, making up for the fact by going and getting health and stuff. I thought Zant's dungeon was interesting as well. <laughs> nice fucking swing. Dude. Honestly, Link just is so stupid. So I'm just gonna swing directly past the motherfucker. I don't even give a fuck. I thought the concept for the Temple of Time was like really cool though. It's probably my favorite idea for a dungeon that hasn't been done yet up until this point. I'm pretty sure the Temple of Time wasn't done. I could be wrong. There might be like older games that have done the Temple of Time and actually made it a temple. I mean, I don't know why they wouldn't necessarily, but... Oh, wait, I'm stupid. I know these guys. I forgot this guy existed. Um, nice. Well, I'm glad I did not pull that out in time. Uh, 
fought these guys a bunch before, dude. Why am I struggling now? I'm so bad. A small key. What the fuck? Is it the hawk from the beginning of the game? Where did it get bombs? Oh, it's that dude. They have a rocket launcher? <laughs> rocket launchers exist? in the Zelda universe, and you're telling me I'm not equipped with it? You're telling me me, who's going up against Ganondorf? Ganon? I don't get a missile launcher? Okay. Let me guess, the, the thing closes, though. Okay, never, never mind. Wow, I'm surprised the boss key was this early, this easy to get. Not that it really matters that much. Interesting, though. They're like, here's the boss key, bub. We haven't been in here. I wonder how fucking large this temple is. Okay, it's five floors. Okay. Oh, this is just this area again. Okay. Is this- I forget, is this just rupees? I think I've already been up here, haven't I? Maybe not. Uh, maybe I need to undo these flames. No. Okay. 
Um, hmm. Maybe I pull this down with my iron boots or some shit. I guess you can't. Interesting. No difference. Okay. Fair enough. Um. Yeah, I wonder what's supposed to be here. I wonder how we get that to uh, spawn. Like there really isn't much else. Uh, well, I guess there's. I get. I'm done. I forgot. I can just go to the right here. <laughs> Haven't gone to the right yet. is just perpetually locked. Knock off the painting. Hmm. Are these dudes just chilling? Not doing anything important. 
Maybe I just go back outside and then it unlocks. here and this led to nowhere right nowhere interesting it gave us a button to hit but that was it oh god i almost fucking walked off would have been bad um mm. fair enough all right um so this is not the way we need to go, probably. Might as well waste an entire heart. No fucking reason. Alright, um... What are we looking at here? Is there anything on the edge of the... Or do I literally just run across? Am I just stupid? Okay, I'm just done.
Is that another one of them? Uh. No. For fuck's sake, dude. Just like right before the end of the game, too. Probably should get some fairies, but I don't know. Like. Is, it, is there like a downside to leaving the temple? Like there's probably some fairies over here maybe. But I bet you they don't respawn because fuck me. You know, why would they? I probably should at least make a save with full health though. And heart. Uh, and fairy. I li do I literally just block? God, I'm so fucking stupid, dude. I literally just block. That's all I do. God, I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb. Holy shit. Uh, well, let's save real quick here. It took one time, by the way. And lo I lost, like, almost none of my health either there. So stupid. Okay. Just a bunch of chests and shit. Hell yeah. Okay, all the small ones are rupees, okay. Some orange root. Is this just all money? Just supplies. Do I need slingshot seeds? Bomblings. Okay. Sure. Haven't had to use those at all. Full game yet. So, I 
any fairies at all, dude. No. <laughs> I don't think there's a single fairy here. Huh? Oh, there it is. Save again real quick here. Alright, I don't know if I can exit and then go back in to get another fairy, but... Okay. Why is Zance... Why is Zant's place the only place that doesn't have respawning fairies? That doesn't make sense to me. Okay, well we have two fairies, that's nice. That hopefully should help. Is there any of these other chests that have bombs in them, maybe? There's arrows... I guess let's just try and open every chest. Okay, bombs, good. Welcome back to you, man. Alright, well... I think that... means we are ready to try and fight Ganon. I don't know if I'll beat him today. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully. Assuming this is Ganon right here. One second, I'm gonna rip the shit. Ah, that's appropriately apoc apocalypse. <laughs> no, that might be something. <laughs> Where's your bitch ass ga at, Ganon? Where you at, huh? Oh. Shit. It's Zelda.
Welcome to my castle. <laughs> so you're Ganondorf. Oh fuck, boys. <laughs> I've been dying to meet you. Your people have long amused me, Midna, to defy the gods with such petty magic, only to be cast aside. How pathetic. How very pathetic. Pathetic as they were, though, they served me well. Their anguish was my nourishment. Their hatred bled across the void and awakened me. I drew a deep of it and grew strong again. Your people have some skill, to be sure, but they lacked true power. The true power of the dark side. <laughs> the kind of absolute power that those chosen by the gods wield. He who wields such power would make a suitable king for this world, don't you think? Ha! <laughs> such conceit. But if you're one, uh, but if you are one of the chosen wielders of power, as you claim, I will risk everything to deny you. Shadow has been moved by light, it seems. How amusing. Very well, deny me then. Yes, try to deny me, you and your little friend. Oh shit. <laughs> Both of you, faithless fools who dare to take up arms against the King of Light and Shadow. So you ch <laughs> what the so you cho choose, and so you shall feel my wrath. Super crazy possessed Zelda, let's go. Time to kick her ass. Ganon's puppet Zelda, oh shit. What, what's my inventory? I will hookshot you, Zelda. Oh, wait, is this just Ocarina of Time again? <laughs> you did a good job, Link. You could have just ran just a little faster. Oh, I. Uh, okay. Alright, this is gonna be fun with motion controls. Uh, yeah. Yeah. This will be fun. This will be fun with motion controls, I feel it. Maybe I need a shooter after that. I don't know. Cool. Motion controls, awesome. Yeah, I figured motion controls. As soon as I knew it was gonna be this kind of fucking thing, I was gonna be like, oh man. Man. Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. God damn it. Alright, 
on motion controls. Uh, I don't know if that did anything. Gonna do anything? Uh, like maybe I could toss a bomb at her or something. Maybe I could just shoot her with a normal arrow. Don't you? Fuck. Fuck you, Zelda. Power of Christ compels you. <laughs> God damn you, Zelda. I thought you loved me. You know, Zelda, those tattoos don't look good on you. Ganon. Oh shit. <laughs> Do I get my iron boots out? <laughs> I swear to god, if this is a ramming section. Oh no. I don't, I don't know if it actually is or not. It might be. Say one of those ones like the goat at the beginning. You know? Multi dimensional Ganon. Where the fuck are you, bro? Uh, okay, I don't think it's the iron boots. <laughs> don't think it's that. Um. Maybe it's still- maybe it is the iron boots, I don't know. Maybe I'm just not getting it right. I- I'm pretty sure it prompts you if you are gonna do, like, one of those things. One of those ram things. So, what the fuck am I needing to do? Do I shoot him? Like, like bomb arrows? I don't know. Like, I guess am I supposed to, like, leave a bomb and hope he runs into it? Oh, well, fucking ball and chain worked, hell yeah. Oh, okay. Well, it did something. I'll do that then, I guess. <laughs> what the fuck do you want, Midna? The f Out of all of the times that you could possibly distract me, what now? Did you see under his belt? See his belly? That's where he was injured long ago during his sentencing. That's his weak point. Oh, thanks. Thanks, Midnight. You fucking really helped there. That was very helpful. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, hey, a fairy. This is way better just to sit here with me spinning that and then turning. He debated me. What am I supposed to do about that now? Like leave a bomb? Okay, nah, I don't know. Maybe I shoot him in. Oh, you know what? Maybe I sh maybe I bomb shoot him in the stomach when he's dropping from above. Try that. Oh fuck, damn it, no, no, that's not what I wanted. <laughs> uh, I should, I guess, if he's just gonna drop from above anyway, I guess I don't even need to do uh, to bring out the ball and chain, huh? Well, we'll see. Shut the fuck up, Midna, god. Like, it's the final boss fight. Let me figure it out. Oh. Maybe I... Maybe I bring out the ball and chain, and then once he... Like, how fast does it take to put it away? Maybe I put it away. Maybe I, like, I have to psych him out. Maybe I have to throw it at him. I don't know. Maybe I have to throw it at him and then put it away. I don't know if that'll work, though. Seems like it wouldn't work. Oh, or maybe I just have to wait until he just does this. Right, or not. Fucking damn it. <laughs> I tried. He's changing his strategy. Not only can you not confuse him, but you won't be able to attack. Beast against beast. How about matching an evil beast against a sacred beast? Well, I didn't even know I could turn into fucking wolf link right now. I kind of forgot you were with me, Minda. Thought you were, like, trapped behind the void. I guess that was during the Zelda fight. Fucking Midna backseating. Oh, it's it now it's ramming. Except with the dog. I forget, do they ever do that at any point in the game? At all? With the dog? I mean, maybe. I, I feel like I vaguely remember something like that. Yeah, why not? Uh, let's just make it a ramming thing with the dog. This time. Was I supposed to hold A or... I think I did the dash. I think I accidentally pressed A just like a tiny bit too early or something. We still have two fucking fairies. So. And I didn't even know about the corner fairy, but that's fine. Well, we just, yeah, I just need to press it in time. Fuck. Link, throw him then. There you go, you idiot. Ganon, don't tell me you're this much of a little bitch. You can't... This can't be it. This can't just be it. 
This can't be it. This can't be the end of the game. Ganon, I swear to God, you better attack me with something else. If, if I literally had a harder time with the fucking knuckles because I'm stupid. God damn it, that's the end, isn't it? God damn it, that's the end. Why is Ganon so easy? Like, the, the, bra the iron knuckles, granted, I was totally stupid and didn't know that all you had to do was block, but... For princess, I... I... Maybe it's still not over, though. Say nothing, Midna. Link, you are dying now. <laughs> Your heart and mine were as one, however briefly. Such suffering you have endured. And it's all your fault. Yeah, I was gonna say, this, this can't be the end. This can't be the end. That was easy as shit. Alright, Zelda, now... Harness your powers. Maybe it is still the end, and this is just a debate, not the end. But it really is the end. Is Midna sacrificing herself? Oh god, Midna, no! No, Midna! What are you doing? What What actually are you doing? I don't even know what she's actually doing. What, is she swallowing up Ganon's soul? Ganon's Andros face-ass soul? Maybe I fight as Midna. Tell me I fight as Midna. If I fight as Octopus Midna, that'd be sick. Oh, no, okay. It's just a cutscene. Well, I guess GG, huh? <clears throat> Maybe. Maybe there's one last Hyrule field fight. <laughs> okay, just blow up Hyrule Castle, no big deal. Oh shit, it's Ganon! He killed Midna! Oh shit! <laughs> he, he did it! <laughs> what a twist ending! Oh god! <laughs> Oh shit! What, now we're gonna joust? Wow, Midna fucking died. <laughs> Damn! That's intense. Spirits of the light, wielders of the great power that shines far and upon the lands of our world. In my honor of need, or hour of need, God, I'm so bad at reading. Grant me the light to banish evil. Is that the end? Did I just get debated like seven times <laughs> about what the ending is? Man, in before my disc, just does an error has occurred. Balls. Chosen hero, lend us the last of your power. So it's not over yet. Okay. We are gonna joust. Okay, I'll try and slow Gan to slow Ganondorf with my light arrows. <clears throat> you target him and keep him within range of my arrows. Okay. Where, where the fuck did he go? Yeah. 
So Midna's dead, huh? <laughs> <laughs> That's something I don't have a lot of time to to accept. <laughs> Dope, yeah, Midna's dead, by the way, guys. I mean, maybe she's not dead, but... God. Wow. Am I supposed to be smacking him with my sword, too? <laughs> Damn it. Ganon's too good. Can we just ride off into the sunset? Yo, Ganon, stop chasing me! Stop chasing me! Oh my god! <laughs> I don't know how this is supposed to work, Ganon. <laughs> Maybe I can bomb arrow him. Fuck, dude. I am getting wrecked. I'll save really quick. I don't know if this will save for this fight or not, but... Get the fuck on there, Link. So weird. Shot, Zelda. That's actually a really good strat. Just spam target. <laughs> Spamming target just makes it a thousand times easier. Okay. Impressive looking blade, but nothing more. Would you hear my desire? Take this foul blade and use it to blot out the light forever. 
That'd be great if I could just choose to end the game with a bad ending. Just join the dark side, Link. Dark Lord Ganondorf. Oh shit. Let's go. What up, Ganondorf? You bitch. Oh, well. Okay, well, he doesn't like that. Yeah, I have no idea how the fuck we're gonna do this. Okay, well I didn't know there was gonna be a fairy here. Oh wait, chance? What? Fuck. The fuck was it saying? Like, it says chance there, but it's like, what does that mean? Do I just have to back away from him? How the fuck did I hit him? <laughs> oh, I guess I hit him like right before he started to. What? I have no idea what the fuck I did. Like maybe he starts just doing something. Maybe like right as soon as he's about to move or something. Maybe not. Oh fuck. Oh shit, that was that was crazy. He hasn't done that. Give me a chance when I'm looking away. <laughs> Stupid game. Is it just totally random when he gives you the chance thing? Yes. Seems pretty random. Maybe I just turn my back to him. Don't look like it. <laughs> just looks like he just does it randomly. Thank <laughs> you. 
need to, I don't know if I should do the jump slashes, just because they're so fucking, the aiming's just so bad. It's really bad. Link is just so bad at hitting attacks that I'm doing, like, when I'm trying to do uh, target attacks. Okay, well, dude, why? Why do you do that when I'm running? Okay. Maybe you can just manip it by running away from him for like two seconds. Is that the end? Yo, GG. That, that looks pretty much like the end. That's a pretty hilarious face. I'm not gonna lie, that was a pretty funny face he just made there. Yeah, it was a good game. It was a good, it was a good video game. He just gets up with the master sword inside of him. Jesus. Do not think this ends here. History of light and shadow will be written in blood. Is it really not over yet? I mean, that's fine if it's not over. I'm down for an epic boss fight. That just looked a lot like the end. That's all I'm saying. That looked like a pretty definitive end. Yeah, that was a good game, though. That was a good Wii game, for sure. Um... Like, overall, I will say, uh, wasn't too much that was, like, annoying at all, really. I would only say, pretty much just Ganon's castle having, like, no health anywhere laying around. So I had to go and farm a little bit because I'm dumb and couldn't fucking fight an iron knuckle because I'm a dumbass. Or is this still not the end? God damn. What do you want from me, game? Is it the end or is it not the end? <laughs> this game. We'll fit we'll see. Oh, did they bring back Midna's that that dark little shadow there at the bottom? A little silhouette there. Midna not die. Damn it, I want it. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Link, Link, goddamn, Link. God damn it, Link. You were, you were going to, you were going to get with Zelda. He's like, no, I want, I want to get with Midna now. Before it's too late. <laughs> Human Midna. What? Say something. Am I so beautiful that you've no words left? He's like, I mean, I mean, I, I, I'm Link, so, nice, sick. Yeah. Well, that's the longest game I've played so far. Granted, it would be probably a lot shorter if I played it, had played it before anyway. Uh, but yeah, blind. I think that was an okay time, like... I, I took a very long amount of time on some very select things, but overall, I enjoyed this for sure. Definitely, definitely a good Zelda game. I can see why people like the game a lot. It's got a good amount of content. It's got a good, it's got like really good items. It's got pretty good dungeons. Um, 
the story's decent, I would say. Pretty good. So. Only, like, um, I can, I can definitely tell it seems like they tried really hard to appease to the Ocarina of Time fans. Maybe not really hard, but pretty hard. Because this definitely has, like, a, I don't know, kind of has that Ocarina of Time kind of vibe going, but it's pretty good. Pretty good. Overall. Yo, what's up, Gusso Juice? Thank you for the GGs, guys. Yeah, um... Like, I think the only thing that I would say about this game is some of the bosses are, like, a little easy, I guess. Like, Morpheal was pretty easy. Um, I remember the second boss being pretty easy. Like, a good amount of the bosses are not terribly difficult, but... I'd say some of them are, like, I'd say some of them are definitely, like, I'll take a little bit of thought, so that's nice. Only one, I would say, like, Morpheal is a good example, and, like, the Temple of Time spider boss. That one also is fairly easy from what I can tell. Um, uh, but, you know, like, overall, it's a cool game. Um... And I wouldn't say the Ocarina of Time or Majora's Mask or other Zelda games really, you know, they all have like some easy bosses too and stuff. So overall, uh, yeah, it's a so it seems like a pretty solid Zelda game, especially if you tried to 100% the game. I imagine it'd be kind of cool. You'd still just wish there was only more. I'm sure that Breath of the Wild is something really cool. So that's kind of the thing, is like you just kind of always just want more Zelda to play. <laughs> when, you, uh, when you get done with one game, it's like, fuck. I wish there was more. <sighs> so. Cool shit. Cool shit. So we're, uh, I didn't, um, I didn't really mention, uh, until now that I'm bringing it up, but, uh, well, I mean, I guess I mentioned it on Discord, so never mind, but, um, I will be doing some speedrun, like a good amount of speedruns, not of Zelda, sorry, <laughs> but of, uh, just a bunch of different games and stuff over, hopefully the next, like, two or three weeks or something. Um, and, and I'm hoping to try and do, like, a, maybe a speedrun marathon-ish thing. Not, not with, like, other people, but just, like, of my own runs. Just doing some, doing some, uh, doing some runs and doing a, just doing sorts of runs, basically. So, hopefully, uh, it'll be some good stuff to focus on for a little bit. But we'll get back to the Wii completion stuff. In about a week or two, I'd say. We'll start up number 201, which is, if you guys were wondering, is going to be SpongeBob's Truth or Square. So, I've heard that game is not super terrible. <laughs> it's at least, from what I can, what I've heard from people who speedrun the game, it's probably like the third, like the third best speed, SpongeBob speed game. Uh,. So I might look into speedrunning that too, but uh, overall, yeah, I'm not sure when we'll start up Truth or Square, but eventually, eventually we will, um, and yeah, we have a good amount of other games on the way for Season 3, I'm trying to basically just make each season, each season, uh, 100 games, so. This is technically the end of Season 2. It's a good end. This is a good game to end on. I'd say it's a bit more climactic than Mario Party 8 was, but Mario Party 8 was a good game for Game 100. Mario Party 8's just a decent Wii game overall. Pretty good one. But, yeah. This one was good. 
I'd say I enjoyed this one probably more than most games I've played so far. Like, some games were maybe better just in terms of enjoyment, uh, in terms of them being funny or, uh, or stuff like that. But yeah, this was a good game in terms of just good new game to play that I could pretty much count on being pretty solid. The motion controls aren't great. <laughs> the sword swinging motion controls are not amazing. And thankfully it's not very much required that you're an amazing, uh, that you're amazing at reacting to, uh, stuff and swinging in time, but... Well, I guess this is farewell, huh? Light and shadow can't mix, as we all know. Wow, that's a great m moral. <laughs> that's a great moral. You just, after all that, oh, that, yeah, light and dark can't mix. Yeah, that's a g good, good morals game. But never forget that there's another world bound to this one. Like, you couldn't just even clarify. Shadow and light are two sides of the same coin. One cannot exist without the other. Like, it's supposed to be a yin and yang kind of thing, probably, but it's just like, you could have worded that a million times better, Twilight Princess. Just saying. Just saying. I know now the reason the goddesses left the mirror of Twilight in this world. They left it because it was their design that we should meet. Yes, that is what I believe. Well, your belief is stupid, Midna. I don't care. Zelda. Your words are kind, and your heart is true. If all in Hyrule are like you, then maybe you'll do alright. Thank you. Well, the princess spoke truly. As long as that mirror is around, we could meet again. Balls. I. Washed my toilet with your toothbrush. See you later. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, it was a good game. Um, I look forward to watching speedruns of this now. <laughs> because now I actually know part, at least what's being skipped. You know? So. That's cool. Because, yeah, I've watched a couple runs of Twilight Princess before. Not, like, all the way through, I don't think. But, um... But yeah, there's a lot of crazy ass tech, and they do shit just totally out of order, which is funny. It's pretty good. It's a really. Like, it's pretty broken despite it still being a really long run. It's pretty nuts how fucking ham the Zelda community goes on finding shit for games. It, it really is just crazy. Because. I mean, I honestly couldn't tell you about, like, too many things that I fa that I ran across that seemed uh, glitchy or anything, so, like, maybe only a couple things that might not have been intended, and I didn't, I didn't use any of the, uh, I didn't use that, um, that jump slash exploit you can do with the boomerang, I never used that at all, and I don't think that's necessarily intended to be used to skip stuff or whatever, but. I know you can just like jump slash way farther than you can normally jump in a lot of cases, so you can just make a lot of uh, a lot of gaps, a lot of jumps, just by and just by having the boomerang and a sword, because it's just ridiculous. So I'm sure there's all sorts of stuff that you can just normally you'd have to go way the fuck out of your way to to go and well you know maybe just some stuff in a temple like you need to go through a couple rooms to 
to activate this or that, and I wouldn't be surprised if you can just skip a lot of it with just having a well-positioned jump slash. It's not quite as funny as like Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask where like a lot of like ledges that you're not supposed to be able to climb up. You can just like climb up them by like side flipping or uh, back flipping into them and stuff like that. You can't really do that in this game I don't think. GG, boys. Yeah, it was a good game. Good game. Enjoyed it a good amount. <laughs> Can't skip. Nice. Well, okay. Well, that was a good stream. Um, I'm going to go ahead and end the stream here. <laughs> uh, and I will hopefully be back later. Well, it's like 2 in the morning here right now. I'll hopefully be back later today. Uh, maybe, I don't know for sure, but, um, <laughs> but, but yeah, um, we'll, uh, we'll be back with some speed runs. I'll probably just be de-rusting some things and re, uh, and routing some things, I guess. There's not really a ton I have, like, planned specifically. I more just want to speed run all sorts of random crap over the next little bit. Maybe and figure out which one I like. Figure out which games I want to spend a good amount of time on. I'll probably be uh, I'll be running some more Mario Party 4 for sure. I'll be probably looking into running some Mario Party 1 as well. Um, I might look into doing some Pokemon Stadium 1 runs, maybe. Uh, I'll also be looking into doing, uh, some rental rando, just because it seems like all you have to have is, like, the cart to do rental rando. All you need to do is just go look online at some randomized team thing. I don't really know how that works, but I want to look into doing rental rando just for the fuck of it. Just for, like, a stream or something. Maybe more streams than that, but, uh, depending on if people like it, but either way. Um... Uh, yeah, there's, and then some other stuff, like I'll probably look into running some more Shrek Extra Large again, um, just to look into getting a PB, and um, yeah, there's like a couple other games that I uh, haven't just, haven't really streamed much lately, so yeah, I'll probably look into doing that, but 
Anyway, yeah, thanks for hanging out, Wineville. Thanks for hanging out. Everyone else who came to watch today and hang out. Hope you all have a good rest of your night. This was, yeah, Twilight Princess was a good game. I enjoyed it a lot. I'm glad that I got to uh, experience it uh, for the first time. It was a good game. So, yeah. Anyway, appreciate you guys hanging out. Peace out.